Hello everyone. So just so you know, this is Garam. Yes, I know I named myself after something. Anyway, go on and try it, Garam. Yes. Do not mind that I named myself from Skyward Sword. I have no idea what to name myself. Anyway, we're heading to the uh, the sanctuary for the second Lokomo. Uh, please note that I don't actually understand why there is no audio. Anyways, I do how I, this is pre-recorded and uh, by me, of course, and I'm just uh, using my voice to sort of layer on top. So anyway, we're heading to the sanctuary. But first, I'm uh, gonna head to Castle Town. My driving's not exactly the best, so if I make a mistake, do not judge me! Yeah, so, there's still some things I need to grab. Uh, okay. Ah, home sweet home. I wish we had time to... to oh, by the way, yada 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 yada. Uh, basically, a uh, bunch of stuff. Anyways, I'm just going to break the spot here. Look around, try and find a shop. And, uh, that does not look like something a shop would have. That's actually like a boss rush sort of thing or whatever, I'm not sure what. Uh, uh, this is the shop. Anyway, so, I'm just gonna walk in here and get myself a shield. 80 rubies, yep, I'm getting. Like that. You got a shield, defend yourself from minor attacks by holding it. Very much gonna help you with anything else. I'm... Damn, why so expensive? Damn, that's a lot! That is way too much. Uh, definitely not. Sorry about that. Yeah, just so you know, I'm actually using an emulator. Because <laughs> I can't actually afford one myself. Damn it. Anyways, so I'm just, uh, gonna see if there's anything. Nope, nothing in that pot. If you can hear something in the background, don't mind that. You even have a stomach. No, no, I can't think about that. We have to go all aboard! Yeet! Yeah, I think I figured out why there's no audio. I can't... It, but... I actually don't know why. It, it's confusing and I, I just can't figure it out. Okay, let's go full speed. I, As you can see, I do not have the normal cannon. I'm just gonna keep quiet for now because I can't waste my breath. So, for the animals, you gotta, uh, blow your horn. But, for me, I just tend to slow down so I avoid hitting them. And, uh, oh, there's a bird up there. And, as for the monster, uh, you gotta keep blowing the whistle, as you can see that I am doing. And when it dives, blow it, and, uh, it should scare it off. Now, once you get a cannon, you won't need to do that. But, if you like to, that's simple. The signs are to indicate which speed you should go at, but you don't really need to do that unless you're carrying something or someone. So, as I said, the uh, monsters get scared away by loud noises, so when they dive, immediately do. Oh, yeah, and as for the animals, as I said, the thing that looks like a question mark is actually, uh, it actually means to blow the whistle. Now, uh, let's just wait a little, cause, now that, to get to this part, this is, uh, actually a very tricky and confusing bit. Now, it took me ages to figure out a pattern to it. Who it? But I suggest you watch others. Now, I've done this the first time. I'm okay. So this is how it is. This forest feels somewhat odd. Also, I will tend to read there, read what they say. So, in this particular woods, see that tree? The tree with the 
branch sticking out, you have to follow them. But there's a particular trick to it, which I figured out a pattern. So there's not any particular pattern in which you follow, but when it comes to the trees that you see pointing to a certain direction, you have to follow those trees, except for the fourth one. Because that one is meant as a trick. You go the other way. Uh, you will see that soon. Wow, only five and a half minutes, huh? Anyways, so, second one. Go the same direction as the branch is going. Sorry. Not actually feeling rather well. Never mind. For the third one, follow. Now, at the fourth one, I thought I messed up for a moment, and then I realized that I got it right. Now, for the fourth one, you want to go the opposite way. It's not just right, 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 left. Follow the branches of the trees, but don't follow the fourth one. Go the opposite way. Now, we are at the fourth sanctuary, where I think I broke the reality. Anyways, let's just, uh, never mind. We finally made it out of there. The forest was so creepy. <laughs> yada, 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 yeah. yeah. Now, let's just save here, and, uh, well, we have to get to the Locomo, which is, as you can see, at the top left. Please note that I am using a uh, emulator. Yeah, those things are pretty weak. How does a chicken and a chest uh, get up there anyway? Now, what I did is uh, actually rather confusing for me, for myself as well. Oh, but there is a sort of trick to it. I didn't get it at first, but hey, no one likes you, crow. Well, some like you. I mean, I like ravens, crows, spiders, snakes, but who's counting? Anyway, so what you want to do is, yeah, I, not that, not that. Because when you go back here, yeah, the, the bridge closes on you. I know because that mess happened to me. See? Very annoying. Now then. Just gotta run! Yeet! Yeah, I I hit that on by accident. accident. Anyways, yeah. So, you get this stamp after you visit Nico back at home. The starting village. But as you can see here, there is a... There is need for bombs. So... And we can't exactly get there. But, uh, naturally, I will try to get there. Uh, I don't even know how I hit those. Ignore the habit. Uh, okay, let's go. Well, I might try. Run, 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 run. Dang it. Yeah, I, I actually did. Now run! Yay! Now then, see this thing? This actually teaches you certain songs once you get there. Now, the at first I was wondering what these statues are doing here. Now it's just gonna take hearts from the snakes. Yeah, I'm just gonna act as if I don't know what's going on. Hmm. Bunch of statues. Someone's... Some are facing each other. Two stone statues that face each other. Okay. Uh, this one. Nope, nope, nope. That one. Certainly doesn't face that one. Uh, this one. Definitely not. This one. Faces that one. Yep, yep, that's gonna do. Connect the two stone statues. Yep, these two. The first time I just did a bunch of random combinations at first. <laughs> it was very odd. Now then. <clears throat> I'm gonna put on my best reading voice to try and imitate Gage. Are you Gage? Gage of the Locomos? Why, yes, I'm Gage. Oh, he seems quite a bit more informal than Angie, doesn't he? What was that now? If you got something to say, I'd like to hear it. Oh, I'm sorry, I meant no offense. Actually, Angie sent us to speak with you. 
Oh, yes, of course, you're the one youngsters with that wonderful flute. How did you know about that so quickly? And you're here to restore those spirit tracks to the forest temple, yes? Yep. Um, I mean, yes, yes, of course. Why would you falter? We need to recharge the tower spirits with the energy of the forest. Whatever that means. Yes, that real map of yours can't do it alone. You need more spirit tracks. Well, there is a way. Would you like to hear it? Of course. The tracks that disappeared. You need to know a special song. Song? Oh, please don't make me sing it on my own. Song is a duet that requires two sacred instruments. A duet? Oh, good. My cello and your spirit flute should do the trick. Hold up. That's a cello? I thought that was an oversized violin. With both instruments playing the song, we can restore the real map's energy. So, shall we try it? Yes, best of luck to you. I really should be the one doing it, but I can't. I'm sure you'll do a wonderful job, though. Uh, I don't know whether to be worried or confident. It's very confusing. Like, the yada 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 of how to play the spirit flute. I was just trying to figure out why it wouldn't work at first, and then I realized. Hold it. It was at this moment that I realized that I had uh, forgotten to activate the microphone. So, I just uh, sorted it out. I'm going to do as well as I can. Yeah, uh, if you want, you can skip this bit of training. Yeah, it was still giving me a problem. Was, I had to do it somewhat quiet. One, two, three. Nope, that did not work. As I said, you can just skip this. Well, that do. Goodbye. For me, it's like, first time's the charm. For the real thing, yes! Don't let my part confuse me. I mean, you. Yeah, sorry you can't hear it. Yeah, for some reason my flute glitched. <laughs> that part was just extra. Yep. If... If I could figure out why the volume wasn't working on this thing, then I would be able to, to show you what I was playing, but... Ah! It won't work. He's... You completed the duet with Gage, the locomotive of the Forest Realm. Forgive the long pause. The Forest Realm app has started glowing. New tracks have appeared. Wonderful, wonderful. The tracks to the fourth temple have been restored. You're a natural at that, Girahim. And you sounded really good, too. Now let's head to the forest temple. Please note that I had no idea what to call myself. So unless you have any better suggestions, I'm sticking with Girahim. Thank you so much, Gage. Yes, I suppose. Good luck, but be careful. The forest temple can be very dangerous. Hey, I've dealt with phantoms. Phantoms that could kill me in one hit. Anyway, so, uh, yeah, let's just save. And this will be the end of the recording. Uh, so, uh, I don't know what to say.